please rise. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, everyone. It's a brisk Monday morning and we're shorthanded, so Sergeant Nick and I will be handling everything ourselves. So first, let's get weather out of the way. It's currently 38 degrees outside. At lunch, it'll be 49 degrees. And after school, it'll be 54 degrees. Enjoy it while it lasts because it isn't going to get any higher than that today. Be sure to check out the latter part of our broadcast for news and sports. But first, for lunch today, on lines one and two is taco meat with scoops. Line three is a soup and salad bar featuring chili. Line four, popcorn shrimp. And line five is Wild Mike's Pizza. A happy birthday goes out to Brandon Castle, Isaac Hunter, and Ivan Mejia. Let's switch over to sports. On Sunday, the girls' bowling team, Child Green Castle, take on Western Boone. Although the match was tight, the girls were able to come out on top, increasing their record to 3-1. and one. The top scorer for the dogs was Jordan Anderson with a 184. The next match will be Sunday, November 4th in Crawfordsville. The FHS Competition Cheerleading Squad participated in the IAS P State Cheer Championships this past weekend at Greenfield Central High School. Our squad didn't make the finals, but they did an outstanding job performing their competition routine. They represented Frankfurt High School with grace and class, and the coaches were very proud of their efforts and determination. Girls, you nailed it. The FHS competition squad will participate this coming Saturday in the Time Out Division at Newcastle High School. Performance time is 10.32 a.m. Join us this Saturday, November 3rd, to support your hot dog competition cheer squad at Newcastle High School. The girls would love to have your support at the competition. Wrestling practice starts today. If you plan on competing, be there by 3.15. Last Friday, also, I said that the fall sports night was on Thursday, but it appears that I lied to you, as is actually tomorrow at 7 p.m., and the first team all-conference banquet is going to be taking place this Thursday at 7 p.m. That concludes everything regarding sports. Now time for the news. Books and bagels will happen this coming Friday morning. If you don't have a book yet, please see Mrs. Willoughby. 32 Frankfurt DECA members are attending the Indiana DECA Fall Leadership Conference held at Bankers Life Fieldhouse today. Students are attending workshops, listening to sports and entertainment industry speakers, networking, and watching the Pacers versus Trailblazers game tonight. When you see DECA members wearing their conference t-shirts in school Tuesday, be sure to ask them about the day. Today is October 29th. If you happen to be hungry from 4 to 9 p.m., why don't you stop by Dairy Queen to help support the band? Or, if you don't want Dairy Queen, you can pick something up at Papa John's either today or tomorrow, as 25% of their sales will be d donated to the Frankfurt Drama Club. Don't forget to get your DECA cookies. This week, DECA will be selling chocolate chip, M&M, and sugar cookies. Remember, DECA cookies are two for one dollar and can be found outside of room 133. Get them while they're warm and before they run out. Congratulations to those of you who performed in the play Freaky Friday. Thank you for the hard work you guys put into making this play possible, from Mr. Taylor to his cast and crew as well as a thank you to those of you who came out and supported our actors. Drew Grismer represented Frankfurt High School on Friday, October 26th at the DAR Good Citizen Essay Writing Contest held at Ivy Tech in Frankfurt. The Clinton County winner will be announced on November 17th at the Captain Harmon Oy DAR Chapter Meeting at the Frankfurt Community Public Library at 10 a.m. The county's winning essay will be sent on to be judged at the state level. Go Drew! Hobby applications are available in student services and are due by November 9th. Make sure to stay tuned for more info regarding Hobby this week. And it appears that's it for our jam-packed and <laughs> short-handed announcements today. Be sure to like and subscribe to stay up to date with all our broadcasts and have a great day. See ya.